Jesus is Lord. I know, another video. Here's the deal. Are you ready? I'm going to say this, and I'm not afraid to say it. Like it or not, believe it or not, all of the stuff that I've been saying, everything, everything I've been saying, and when I watch my videos from months ago, and even months and months ago, and then I look at the news and how everything in the news is starting to line up, not with what they're reporting, not with what the news story is, but with what God's word and what, what I've been proclaiming by the power of the Holy Spirit and by what I've been saying is written here in the book of, in, in God's word, in the Bible. Here's what I'm saying, and this may come across as arrogant, but I'm just going to tell you. It's all coming to pass exactly as I said, and we see the beginnings of it, and we see it, stuff that I could not have known six months ago is now happening and has become clearly evident that it's going to happen. Other things that I've said, it's just a matter of time before it becomes more evident. And other things, there's been things that the Lord tells me, and the more research I do on it, and the more happenstance that like, I'll accidentally watch a video, and somewhere halfway through that video, I see a verse of, of the Bible in a different translation. All of a sudden, I get a revelation from that. Or watching, like watching, uh, I barely ever watch Sid Roth, but I decide I'm going to watch this one. The lady on Sid Roth is a proven prophet. She says some stuff that's exactly, exactly, exactly what I've been saying. The point is, all of God's prophets and saints are going to be saying the same thing. It's all going to come into agreement, and you get a really big, clear picture of it. And after the fact, at that point, you'll be able to look back and say, wow, everything happened exactly as they said. But the whole point is for you to be ready before. That's the whole point for you to say, yeah, okay, not only are you saying this, but a dozen other prophets are saying it, and it's right at the door. And not only that, but when you line that up with one prophecy says Obama is the last president in the United States, another prophecy says destruction or some crazy thing is going to happen before the election to postpone the election. Another prophet is saying Russia is going to invade. Another prophet is saying from a long time ago, then you have the word of God, the Bible, where it says the mark of the beast comes out, Babylon, the great false. It's all coming to pass, you guys. It's all coming down. And you can say I'm a false prophet all you want, but talk to me in five years. That's what I've always, that's when, that's how long it has always been. I've always had people call me after three years or, or tell me that after three years I, proph I prophesied something to them more than one time. And they just thought, whatever, I'll receive that. Yeah, that's what I'm believing for. But three years later, they thought about the prophecy and they got mad at me. Stupid false prophet. Wanted to call me and say, what you said, you shouldn't have said that. That wasn't God. That's not what's happening. Then, two years later, after five years, they call me up and say, Everything you said is happening exactly as you said, and I'm in the middle of it right now, and I thought you were a false prophet. So I'm not worried about it. As a matter of fact, what inspires me to make more videos and to be more bold in what I'm saying is when I see everything coming to pass. And then I go, oh yeah, I better start saying the dates that God's given me. February through March 2016. That time of no wind, April. Now if I'm wrong, good, I hope I'm wrong. At the same time, we will see. There's some dates again. Nobody knows the day or the hour. If I knew the day or the hour, I'd probably start proclaiming it. And then somebody in... in in the enemy's camp would say, well, this guy's proclaiming this particular day and hour. We're definitely not going to do it then. Anyway, praise God. Jesus is Lord. Time is running out. Let him who has an ear to hear, let him hear what the Lord is saying.